Howdy doody everybody, my name is Kev Gooey, and welcome back to Nico Para. In the last episode, Chakla talked about the past, and how I took care of her, and she was just spilling out all of her feelings of why she, was, why she wanted to stay. She yearned for me so earnestly. Now we'll find out what my answer will be. For her to so innocently believe in me, there should be no reason for me to be against it. Oh, so you're actually going to let her stay? Let them stay? That day, Chocola and Vanilla became an important part of my family. As long as they were with me, the days would be bright and enjoyable. There you go. Let them stay. I was simply selfish for just leaving home like that. Oh, maybe. Yeah, a bit. I didn't want to get my dear family wrapped up in my selfishness. Or have them experience any unnecessary hardship because of me. Hmm, the family is family though. You two are important to me, after all. Oh. My inner conflict was disrupted by Vanilla. Vanilla had returned at some point with no drinks. And she looked straight at me as she sat at Chocolate's side. Oh, so you just want to be with Chocolate? Oh, so sweet. I mean, you two are twins, right? There you call. Vanilla? Huh. Wow. Pretty strong what she said before. Oh. Yeah, it is uh, a bit wrong. それに大事な人が大変ならなおさらそばにいたい。ああ。何ができるかはわからないけど。Yay! It was as if her gentle, warm, and soft smile had become the setting sun. I mean, yeah, yeah, I mean, she really smiles when she does. It's a really nice smile. These uncharacteristic words from Vanilla deeply penetrated and seeped into my heart. So it's Shigure that let them follow me. So that's why no one answered the door when I went there. And that's why she doesn't want them to come back unless they really wanted to or she won't take them back oh that makes more sense now oh really my sister wanted to come with me oh there is not even the faintest bit of hesitation. 
There were such honest and absolutely straightforward words. Who am I to dictate chocolate and vanilla's happiness? Yeah, you can't dictate people's happiness or dreams or goals. Only those words continue to strongly resonate in my mind, which was otherwise empty. Aww, they really do love me. Yeah, their love is very strong. Yeah, Kasha, let them stay. I believe that too. She was on the verge of tears. But Chocolate's face lit up. Hmm? They were nothing but absolutely pure, genuine words. What does that mean? Humans really are at a loss for words when it comes to cat girls, huh? Saying no to their words was not something I could bring myself to do. I couldn't... I couldn't even do it either. Even before all of this, I wanted them to stay. <gasps> it won't be like it was back at home. You can't just live here however you like, got it? Alright, Kasha's letting them stay! Yay! No? Well, it depends. The dreary moment seemed to be blown away by her dazzling smile. Despite all this talk about family, perhaps I was the one that didn't really believe in it. Hey, hey, you speak for yourself, Kasha. I believe in it. Thinking about all this from their perspective, it was very simple. Although I thought it was all still so immature. Perhaps cat girls were more human than humans were when it came to honesty. Huh. That might be correct. They seem really honest about everything. And sincere. From here on out, we need to do our best all together. I feel like that's like the Japanese saying, we need to do our best. I'll do my best, you know. Hey, just occasionally is good enough. Hey, 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 you don't try to you trick me into doing it occasionally for fatty tuna. Hey, what's Matsuzaka beef? But A4 grade, fatty meat. Is that all you guys have been eating at home? Even if the road ahead of us is uncertain. I lovingly rub their heads, disheveling their hair. Aww. Alright, why don't we head back to the shopping district then? <gasps> what does that mean? Are we gonna buy them shampoo? Wait, we just went shopping? We have to go buy that shampoo you guys like, don't we? Alright, yay! Oh, I am cool. And then and then you just And then I just pictured like like you know, you look up in the air with your with your your hand on your chin and you have that like a streak of light go shing <laughs> uh, that's what I just imagined. Hey, hey, you don't be putting that in my head right now. Oh, okay. Well, today is a celebration, so why not? 
。ゆぴー。ご主人太っ腹。さすがは私たちのご主人。They're slowly brainwashing me. I think that I'm so generous and I'll eventually buy them all fatty tuna and fatty meat. I'm on to you too. I'm glad that you guys are with me still. Just this once, okay? This was the beginning to a bright new life. And together with the happy and high spirited chocla and vanilla, we took the first steps towards it. Alright! Wow, that was a really lovely、uh, introduction opening. Cinematic. That was the word I was looking for. Cinematic、uh, scene. That was. That's lovely. And there are other cat girls? Ooh. I want to meet them. Yay! Is everyone real? Find out how chocolate and vanilla are going to help us in the next episode of Nico Para. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you guys did, then please slime that like button and help support me by sharing this video and by subscribing down below. Thank you everybody for watching this episode, and you will hear me in the next one. Goodbye!